there is a website which is like a search engine in order to create images very quickly. This is not it. It's not this one is a playground, but I just opened it because you can take um, prompts. But uh, I will show you the site is a uh, name peakfinder.ai. So at the moment of this video, uh, just today, I read this. It's experiencing a surge in traffic, and our servers are feeling the pressure. So it means it won't be as fast as uh, before yesterday, for instance, when I tried it. But you know, look, for instance, you want a, a picture of a uh, of a, a monkey, voilà. a, a monkey eating a banana. So, so now usually, maybe when we will try it, you will have images already, and you can scroll down. But now it's doing this; it's waiting. Usually you have the image and you scroll down and it generates new images from your prompt. So that's um, a difference between this way and other ways uh, like playground, playground where you can ask for four images at, at a time. So let's say uh, a monkey eating a banana. So if I do create, okay, with a playground, a monkey eating a banana. You can uh, select stable diffusion uh, 1.5 or 2.1 and here you can select four images and the size also. To generate, you have four images at once. So you have uh, okay three and then you need to generate again to have more. But here, well, okay, it has generated four. Again, if I refresh, so usually you, you scroll down and you get more and more images. It's very fast generation. So are they the same? They don't look. Maybe it's stable diffusion 2.1 that they use. So four images, a monkey eating a banana. So this one is fast also. But this one, nothing beats it if it's not uh, experiencing uh, too much traffic. So once you, you have one you want, you can just download it and uh, if you want to upscale it, then you have to use other tools, but it's just to, to have something. So here I took a prompt, if I put it inside and go, it creates the image. I don't know if you saw what I took, I took a prompt from a similar image of a house in a mountain. And so you get many, many. And here you have the settings. You can choose a square, tall or wide. Let's say tall. And do again. And now you have tall images of this prompt. And they are, they are looking nice, I think. It's okay. And wide. Okay, so that's it. That's the only settings you have on this site is the image size. You cannot choose anything. So it's very quick. And usually, as I said, it works instantly. Even faster than uh, this one. Here, if I want to have the image, long image, so I cannot choose table diffusion 2.1, I need this one. A monkey eating a banana. And I need to choose a size, so which will maybe this one. And four images, yes. Okay, and you have more settings here. And of course, with the playground AI, you can then generate variation of. Uh, of some uh, picture you like you can put negative uh, prompt also which is now the standard to avoid for example to avoid the face being cut off you write in negative comment face cut off or bad anatomy for instance if you have to not have two arms and things like this not two arms but i mean uh, four arms so this one has generated a few and you scroll down and usually it always shows as you scroll down. So try it, go to pike peak finder.ai.